Hello, my Soul Garden family. I'm Julie Zipper, and welcome back to another episode of Meditation Vibration. Here we are, Sun in Virgo. Happy birthday, all you gorgeous soul healers of the zodiac. Hope you have a fabulous birthday period. And let's talk about Virgos. Let's talk about these soul healers. What is the Virgo vibration? The Virgo vibration is all about the body. They rule reality. They are in their body, noticing details, noticing all the intricacies of life, the material realm. So what we're going to do this um, transit is we're going to get really into our own bodies and we're going to pay attention to all the myriad of details and subtleties that our bodies are communicating to us. Did you know that your body is working for you, not against you? I'm going to say that again. Did you know that your body is working for you, not against you? If you are experiencing something that is an illness or dis-ease, this is your body telling you you are out of alignment somewhere. And don't judge yourself harshly on that. It's working with you saying, hey, look over here. Hey, listen to me. I got something to tell you. And if you listen, we can heal this together. That's why Virgos are called the soul healers. So this whole transit, we are going to listen to our bodies, we're going to pay attention, we're going to receive messages, and we're going to send light and love. So for this first chapter, we are just going to tune in and start to create some space where maybe there's constriction. So I'm going to talk you through it, and then we're actually going to walk ourselves through it. Hmm. So the first step in this is to get in a space that feels nice and open. So whether you're sitting down, lying down, probably lying down would be really good for this since we're, we're getting into the body. Uh, but it doesn't matter, whatever works for you, just something that feels nice and open. <clears throat> and as you close your eyes, you're going to tune into your body. And my invitation is, what hurts? It could be physical. It could be a physical injury from a long time ago, or it could be something physical that's very present now, very new, perhaps. It could be emotional, my heart hurts, my stomach's in knots. It could be mental, stress, oh, I can't stop thinking, I'm in anxiety, I'm in, I'm in worry. Any of these things. And so that's the invitation, what hurts? We're going to go visit that place, and all we're going to do today is breathe light and love into that space. And let me tell you, that space is aching for it. We're going to have no agenda. We're not going to try and fix it. We're not going to try and figure it out today. The first step is just to create a space around it that is holding it like a mama bear, like a safe container for um, the next weeks for, for the space to start to speak to you and start to communicate with you, okay? So let's all turn within and let's explore this together. Mm. Closing your eyes and let's take three deep breaths together. With your first breath, letting go of any tension or holding on in your physical body. With your next breath, letting go of any tension or holding on in your mental body. And with your final breath, letting go of any tension or holding on in your emotional body. So already we've created some good space. And I ask the question, what hurts? What hurts? And you might think you know the answer, but also just be open. Something may surprise you and just be drawn intuitively to this thing that's calling you, saying, I'm hurting. Pay attention to me. Look at me. Look over here. And as you begin to zone in to where this spot is, where it's living in your body right now, just begin to really expand your breath, expand your energy, 
It doesn't have to look like breathing heavily. Just imagine with each inhale, you're able to grow your energy field. It can look like growing light, can feel like growing a vibration, but bring it to this space that's hurting and just allow it to touch it. That's it, just let it touch it. Let it be there. And you're going to take 10 breaths slowly and deeply. And with each breath, let this light or vibration grow, nurture, love, and hold this hurt. And if it brings up any emotions, good, good. Let it be, let it happen, let it flow. If you think you don't feel anything at first, good. Just keep going, why not? What have you got to lose? And just notice if it shifts in any way. We're not trying to shift it, but just notice if it happens to. Just breathing space, breathing light, breathing love into what hurts. Stay here for as long as you choose, and I will see you next week. Live, love, be. So God.